Come one, come two. This is The Price is Wrong. I am your host, Freakishly Handsome, here to introduce our very favorite contestants. But before that, it's time for a little dance jig. All right, now time for the contestants. That's enough time. First of all, we have Hazel. I don't know your last name. Tell us a bit about yourself. Where are you from? What's your job? What's your job? Um, well, I am from... from North Jersey, Carolina. Okay. I'm from North Jersey, Carolina, and I don't have a job. Okay. You're normal. <laughs> no. Next of all, it's Kiki. You don't know my name. I don't. You just said Kiki. Yeah, I don't. Unfortunately. But, tell us a bit about yourself. Uh, where, where's your job? What's your work? What's your occupation? So, okay, so my parents were taking a vacation in Mexico, so I was born in Mexico, but I actually live in America. It's very confusing. Um, I don't know why I'm here. My mom dropped me off here because she was going to a strip club, and my job is I paint skateboards in my garage and get 20 cents. Now, the real, the real question is, what strip club? The one that you go to. Oh. I didn't know that was leaked. Now, it's time for our next contestant, Dwayne... Uh, wait, what? Does that say Dwayne? I can't read your handwriting. Well, you, you're wearing like a rainbow shirt. Hi. Hi. Tell us a bit about yourself. What's your job and what's your place? I don't have a job. I, I don't work that much. Yeah, but I do live in Pennsylvania. Definitely not with my mom. And but I just I'm just a really big fan of your show, and it's. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just nervous because I'm I'm just a really big fan. I can't believe I got on the show, and I'm so excited to be on the show. And yeah. this is so yeah. cool. And yeah. That's and enough. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That's enough. Okay. Yeah, that's that's enough. enough. okay. Uh, now it is time to introduce our grand uh, first person picker thing. Uh, this is a orca stuffed animal. How much is it worth? How much is it not worth? Uh, now, first of all, you can go first for this. Ooh, ooh, uh, oh. 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 Seven hundred and. Two, one, three. Okay. <laughs> now it's time for Hazel's guess. Um, one point nine three seven. Now it's time. Two, nine eight four nine. You done? Three. That was a good guess. Now it is Kiki. Twelve point three thousand eight hundred and sixty-nine. <laughs> that is incorrect. Oh my gosh, we have a winner. You can go first, and this I will throw at you. Now. Really, dude? It's the yeah, time bro. to pronounce the grand prize. This is a supercomputer. It's got some. Ooh, yeah! It's got all sorts of features some knobs, some buttons. It can do addition, subtraction. Probably something else. Now, this supercomputer is worth about eight point two dollars. Now, what is it not wow. worth? That's amazing. Minus twelve plus zero. That is the answer. I mean, the wrong answer. Okay. That was a terrible guess. Hazel's turn. Forty-three quintillion. Uh, and it's Tom Dwayne's turn. I saw one of those in the commercial, and I, it was, 
Let me do the... You said it was A, though. So I have to get it wrong. I'm gonna guess... Nine... Ten dollars. Nine, ten dollars. That is a good guess. It is now time to reveal the grand thingy. The price is not... Bigger. Sleeker. Faster. Stronger. Legal. Probably. More. Everything. Word. This is IMAX. This year, Apple has brought you the greatest and most powerful computer of all time. Welcome back, everyone. Uh, this is a supercomputer with many features, and we're about to reveal the price. And this is Kiki, Hazel, Dwayne, and now it is time to reveal the price. But reveal it already! Stop the small talk! Dang. That's kind of rude, I like to call man. Big talk. Um, this price... The price is not 43 quintillion dollars. You have won yourself a thing. Yay. How do you feel? Never mind. It is now time to cut to nothing, because we're done. And welcome to the Wheel of Misfortune, where the contestants guess a sentence and see if they can win a prize or win nothing. Today, I am going to be calling upon our guest. First, we have Toby. All right, why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself? Um, <coughs> my name is Toby. Um, uh, is this thing on? Yes. Okay, um, my name is Toby. <laughs> And I, um, what do I say? Oh, yeah, never mind. Um, say where you live or something, um, what your job is. Say anything. Work at a, you probably won't judge you. I work at a post office um, in Texas um, with my loving wife of two months. <laughs> um, her name is Beatrice. Um, she's a bit older than me. I'm also 47. Okay. All right, well, that was very interesting. Come on up, Isabel. Wow. Now tell us personal stuff about yourself. Okay, um, I'm Isabel, and I'm from North Jersey, Carolina, and that's about it. <laughs> All right, that's depressing. Come on up, bro. bro. Very strange day, but still come on up because we can't afford anyone else. <laughs> Well, I'm also from Texas. I run, you know, a lot like of people from Texas. What? A lot of people from Texas. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Fine. I run a factory that produces wheels of misfortune. Uh, I see you got a lovely specimen over there. I think it's the X three hundred. No idea. Not rigged. The. Ooh, hello. Is this on? Yes. New fangled stuff. All right. Now well, let's start with Toby. Come on up and spin the wheel. Okay. How does it work? Wait a second. You spin it. Emotional damage! Ooh, looks like you got zero dollars, but you may still guess a word. Uh, or letter, or whatever. Uh, E. That is incorrect. Come on up, Isabel. Try me better than Toby. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. So get nothing, but you can also guess a letter. Um, you. That is correct. All right, come on up. Bruh. See if you have better luck than Toby. Or good luck like Isabel. You also get nothing, but you may guess a letter. That is incorrect. Go on back to your podium. Hmm. All right, so so far we only have one 
good contestant, but Toby, you may come back up and spin the wheel. All right. Try to be better this time. This one's for my wife, Beatrice. But you may guess a word. Emotional damage. That is correct. All right, now come back up, Isabel. See if we can keep your good luck streak going. Spin the wheel. You also still get nothing. Go on up and guess a letter. How about R? That is correct. What's it say? Run. Liberty Mutual customizes your car insurance. So you only pay for what you need. Liberty, 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 Liberty. Welcome to the trivia show In Jeopardy, where you pick a category of questions and try to answer correctly. Although I don't think you will. Out you come, contestants. Quick it now, quick it now, quick it now. Have a seat, have a seat, have a seat, have a seat. Let's, let's, but before we begin, let's talk, let's have some backstory from each of you. What, what, what's your occupation? What's, what, where do you live? And what are your juiciest mistakes? My occupation is Robot Ivan. I live in that box and I would really love to be freed. Yeah, we, we don't want any of that here. How about you, Elon? What's, what's your history? Oh, no, everybody knows. You can just look it up on the internet. That's okay, it's okay. How about you? How about you? Where, where do you live? What's your occupation? What's all that? I live somewhere on the world, and my job is to go to sleep. Well, you know, they do flag these days. Let's have the first category and the first question. How about you first, Robert? Wait, 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 wait. wait. You, first, you, first. you first ask Elon. I did ask Elon. When? Now, yeah, yes, I did, I did just now. None of that, none of that. Leave it to the host. Now, pick your question. I mean, your category. Pandemic's history, 20s history, Jeff Bezos history, and music history. Mm, let's say... Come on, pick, 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 pick. I don't have all day. Mm, 2000s history. Okay, okay, okay. So, who was the president of the United States in 2020? Hmm. It was you, Elon Musk, wasn't it? Or was that a couple of years later? Wrong, wrong, wrong! That's on, Elon, your question. Which category do you pick, Elon? Hmm? Hmm? I can't hear you. Oh, oh, Jeff Bezos history. Okay, fine, fine. What year was Jeff Bezos born, Elon? What was that? No, you're wrong. The next one. The movie Up. That's a weird answer. Quiet, 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 quiet. Now, uh, pick your category. Pick your category. History. Okay, fine, 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 fine. Now, question, question. Which artist had all top ten song spots in this country? Uh... Hurry up! Mr. Beast. Wrong! 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 This year, Apple has brought you iNoggin. Think the same. We are iNoggin. We are iNoggin. We are iNoggin. Charge your iNoggin with our revolutionary wireless charging system. Transfer data easily with our state-of-the-art airdropping system. It's your computer. It's your phone. It's your wallet. It's an internet chip that connects to your brain. Side effects include vomiting, fever, brain rot, dementia, null effect, blood loss, nothingness, and death. Do not attempt to take out, off without a doctor, plus $59.99 a month for brain access. Welcome back to In Jeopardy, the trivia show where these contestants try to answer the questions and will probably fail. Now, let's have a bonus round, people. Ten seconds to answer the question, starting now. Which, what is the best game show of all time? Ten, nine, uh, eight. The price is wrong. Seven. Wrong! Six. Uh -huh. Five. What? Wrong! Wrong! Four. Three. In Jeopardy! Two. You win the game show! And your prize is 
this very nice cardboard box. Jimmy, I can sleep in this now. Finally, you I can really like replace this dirty like. thing. Uh, this was in jeopardy, folks, and now we're uh, out. You know, they say I'm one of those X-list celebra celebrities, but sometimes I get seen out in public once. But, but, they see me in public sometimes. But, okay, I, I don't know. I, <laughs> I choked. But that doesn't matter because as long as it's entertaining to our audience. Ah, uh, th thank you, thank you. It's state of the art. This thing was put together by a team of individuals. In, in, y yeah, that. Oh, then I forgot. Okay, hold on. I forgot. <laughs> I was not ready. I already forgot. Um, what is the game? I forgot. You try to guess. Okay. Should I just start over? Yeah. So All right. Um, what do I say? Oh, yeah. Never mind. <laughs> Everyone, stop recording. Side effects include vomiting, fever, brain rot, dementia, <laughs> blood loss, uh, death, do not attempt to take off without a doctor, plus $59.99 in the month for brain access. <laughs> Come out, contestants. Right, one by one, one by one, let's, let's, let's not rush. Okay, have a seat, have a seat, have a seat, have a seat. So tell, tell us a bit about yourself, tell us, tell us your, your occupation, where you come from, and especially your juiciest mistakes. Okay, cut. Don't move. Oh, whoa. Don't do that. Also, you are very far from the table, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> can, you, <laughs> can you see anything? <laughs> nope. <laughs> it's just black. Cutting into your...